Hi guys, today we're having another discussion around Plants vs Zombies 3, speculating when we should expect to see the full release of the game. PBZ 3's original release was back in early 2020, and the newer overhauled version was previewed late last year, so is it unreasonable to theorise that PBZ 3's release will be in 2022? Let's find out. Now, of course, there are many ways to go about this, especially as PopCap or EA haven't given us any more information since September 2021. We don't really have any article sources to help us out. But the one thing we do have that can give us a good indication of what stage the project is at is the most recent beta. Sadly, we can't play it now, but I, of course, have all the footage. So with that being said, let's analyze the beta and pick out what aspects of the game we can assume are complete or at least in development. We can either assume from the feedback the devs received that one, the newest version of PVZ3 was received much better than the previous and therefore they have the green light to continue on their current path. Or two, the feedback was again very poor and therefore they've gone back to the drawing board for the third time. So number one, let's assume that although we know there were certain aspects lots of people would have liked to have seen changed or removed, but let's say the beta went as well as they were hoping it would and they've decided to continue working it up into the full game. Now, if we look at the different components of the PVZ3 beta, there seems to be a lot of it that is already complete. We have a variety of biomes like the backyard, Lost Keys Lake and the volcano environments. We also know from data miners that there are at least a couple of other worlds or biomes with potential weather types. A selection of both plants and zombies have been created. Yes, nothing on the amount of plants we're used to, but there are still a fair few. Some new characters, some old. We also have the main world map, which seems to go on further than the beta would allow us to. With that, it seems all the core gameplay is relatively complete. It's all the other, let's say, non-essential, by which I mean not essential for someone to actually be able to play the game, if that makes sense. It's those aspects that are not yet fully implemented. This includes things like the soundtrack, there was the one new track, I believe, and a couple of ones used from the previous version of the game, Crazy Dave and other characters' dialogue, new game modes, challenges, menus, boss battles, etc, etc. Taking all of that into consideration, I think the game is in a very good state. I think a lot of the tough groundwork has been done, and I think progress from here on out will be much faster. I also feel the beta gave us a vertical slice of different levels with varying difficulties, so they could have a lot more levels already complete that they just didn't want to include in the beta. Option number two, if they decided to go back to the drawing board again. I think this one is a little easier to explain based on the time between both versions of Plants vs Zombies 3. If they decided to start again once more, it would take them roughly a year and a half to get back to this sort of stage again, already pushing the game way back into 2023, so I would then assume a 2024 or 2025 release. I think the biggest factor to this theory is the resources and budget the team have been allocated. Like, was it a big fiasco to convince the shareholders initially to basically rebuild the game from scratch? Wages and running costs would have also been paid out, so to restart would have cost them quite a bit of money. With that being quite a large consideration, for me personally, I'm not convinced they are in a position of having the luxury to start again, again. Unless, of course, they have only a small number of staff working on it at the moment, and as discussed in a previous video, they might want to take their time to create a game that they are very confident people will enjoy. I'll say it again, a lot of PVZ's reputation is riding on the next title, so I don't blame them for being more cautious than what we've seen in the past. Now, as much as I think it's great me talking about what I think, but let's move on to what you guys think. So last week, I decided to create a small poll asking when you think Plants vs Zombies 3 will release. And these are the results. As you can see, way over half of you reckon we will see PVZ3 in 2022, which I was actually surprised at. But in all fairness, they have already been working on this game for a number of years. Plus, Plants vs Zombies 2 is coming up to its ninth anniversary, so I think we're definitely due a new game in the tower defense series i also think especially as we've had no new pvz content for quite some time i think a lot of us just want some more plants versus zombies and the sooner we get it the better next with less than a third of the previous amount of votes is 2023 with just 20 percent which i expected to be a bit higher especially if the devs have decided to work at a more careful pace this was kind of the time period i was leaning more towards 
In the third place was 2025 with 14%, which did surprise me. I thought this was going to be the lowest for sure, but I guess it isn't unrealistic with everything that's happened with PVZ recently. Perhaps a step back from the series for a little while might be what the franchise needs. Finally is 2024 with only 4%, which I guess tells us most of us feel the game will be here in either the next couple of years or it's still a very long way off. Overall, my personal opinion is that I think the game will release in 2023. Whilst it's possible for the game to release this year, if they ramp up the number of developers working on the game and get some crunch time in, I don't see why not, but I'd be concerned with the game then being rushed in that case. Especially with how conservative the studio seems to be with sharing any new updates around the game, it says to me either they want to tread carefully and get the game just right, or development is slow and they just haven't got anything worth doing an article on just yet. I think probably what I'm saying is that we could see the game by the end of this year, but I think I'd prefer to see it next year so the game doesn't end up getting rushed and we get a half finished release with the scary we'll fix it later approach. Anyway guys, that's about it for today's video. Let me know your thoughts on PBZ3 in the comments below. When do you think the game will release? But other than that, don't forget to hit those like and subscribe buttons, turn on notifications, and if you want to support the channel further, check out my Patreon page by clicking on screen now or through the link in the description. Okay, thanks guys. Bye.